Hello, my name's Liam and I'm from Donegal in Ireland. I was raised in a Catholic family. We went to Mass every weekend and uh, I just remember going to Knock and Loch Derg and Dunwell and Ards. They're like pilgrimage places in Ireland and uh, just loving the faith when I was wee. But uh, like, and because the year before I was born, my big sister Mary Burnett was born. But she was only, she only loved for two days because she was only 24 weeks when she was born. So from a young age, I remember uh, I always, you know, knowing God was there because mum and daddy always told me that Mary Burnett was with God. So that's what I believe because that's what they told me. So I always believed God was there, but I didn't have a personal relationship with him. So I remember one year a knock with Granny and Grunda and it's the first time I felt God called me to serve him somewhere. I think I was about seven or eight or so. And but as I grew up I just thought it was more of a Wayne's notion, like a child's notion. <laughs> and the as I went on to secondary school and I cared more about fitting in with my friends or, you know, all that so I started drinking and all too because I was a pioneer, took a uh, was inspired by my granddad, became a pioneer when I was 16. But because I wanted to fit in with them, I just started drinking. And that was that. And then it was still kind of, the desire to serve was still there, but I just ignored and ignored and ignored. But after that, I got a job in a hotel and I loved the work in the hotel, like serving people, meeting people at the weddings and all that. But uh, because I loved it, I decided to go to Kelly Beggs, which is a fishing village in South Donegal because uh, there's a hotel management course you can do there so I decided to do that and uh, it turned out when I was there that the, where I was staying was exactly across the road from the chapel. I thought that I would have ended up managing some hotel or something and that'd be me, happy as Larry for the rest of my life but God had other plans. So I started going up to the chapel and uh, just every morning, every evening, just I don't know why but I just started going up and spending just time with him and lighting a candle and after a while I discovered that adoration was on and just seeing my personal relationship with him starting to grow. After a while in Kelly Beggs I felt God calling me again to serve him and I decided I would talk to my parish priest uh, about the call and he put me in touch with Father Rory Brady which is the vocation director up in our diocese in Donegal and he told me about a youth 2000 treat that was happening in Loch Derg. While I was there, there was adoration, and the, I remember thinking, is this wee white thing and the tiny gold thing really Jesus? Is this actually God here in front of me? And uh, during the, the healing service, everybody gets an individual blessing from, with Jesus in the monstrance. And I uh, remember just bursting into tears, realizing that he's actually here. This is actually him here, present. That he loves us that much that he wants to be with us. And so after that, I went back to Kelly Beggs and from going up and down to the chapel again and spending time with him, I started, my relationship started to grow and my desire to serve him started to grow even more. And <clears throat> I heard from other Youth 2000 retreats, a girl from Elaine that used to be here about Holy Family Mission. So I decided to apply and when I got my course done, uh, here I am. <laughs> and at the moment, I'm currently discerning priesthood and We'll see what happens. If it's God's will, that's what'll happen. <laughs> so, we'll see.